like a private setup situation here. It's so cute. So we're getting the Miss America experience. I am super excited today and also super on a mission because we have reservations at the Tiffany's Blue Box Cafe in 30 minutes and I have to get going, but I thought I would vlog really quickly and we're gonna race the clock, so we gotta get going. Definitely taking some shortcuts because today is one of those days and I lost track of time. What time is it? It's 2.32. That's Dobby. Say hi to Dobby. He's the best little doggy in the world. I gotta leave here at three. I'm also doing my hair, makeup, and getting ready. So we're gonna see if I can pull this off. But I'm using the same products that I always do because I know that's what's gonna work. And we're gonna keep going. Not bad, not bad. It's 90% dry, let's go to makeup. We're doing super, super easy today. It's also like daytime, lunch, tea time is like you don't need a full face of makeup. And again, normally I really wouldn't even bother with foundation if I didn't have a little few more friends visiting, but hopefully we're gonna see when their time visiting expires. You know, it's like those relatives that like you can't ask to leave but like you're like ready for them to leave and like you had a really great time. I don't know if I had a great time. That analogy does not apply, but I'm ready for them to leave. So hard. Everything is hard today. You are probably wondering why we are going to Tiffany's Blue Box Cafe. And honestly, we enjoy doing it for fun. My mom and sister and I like have this little tradition of going to tea time whenever we can. And now that like, our schedules have gotten so much more busier with my sister having a baby and our nephew and just life kind of going by so much more quickly. This is like really cherished time that I enjoy having with them because it's just the three of us and it's our time. And I'm not gonna lie you guys, we're going to Tiffany's. We're probably gonna look at some jewelry. Like that's probably what's gonna happen. My sister also planned today so, and she is not necessarily the planner. So I think there is like a little ulterior agenda for me now that I'm in a relationship, which I'm really excited about. And it is way more fun to just like, I mean, who doesn't enjoy just going and browsing and looking and seeing and just seeing what's out there. I think I'm gonna try and wear my hair like a little half up today because I like how the curls are falling in the back. It takes the pressure off styling it in the front, but I feel like I get asked a lot about dating and just like sort of this idea of being in a relationship and telling your parents if you're in a South Asian or just more conservative family in general, because dating was never talked about in my house growing up. And I definitely had boyfriends and I'm pretty sure my parents knew that they were my boyfriends, but like it was never talked about. And the first time I told my mom that, where's my lipstick? Oh, come on, where is she? The way I told my parents that I had a boyfriend was when I was 22 and it was my birthday and I told them on my birthday, I was like, um, can I invite my boyfriend to dinner for my birthday? And people can't get mad at you on your birthday. So I figured that was like a safe gamble. I'd also like graduated. And so like, I just feel like I was a little more adultish, um, even though they had known that I'd obviously been dating. They just wasn't talked about, but this was like the first time I really like said it, said it. Um, so yeah, told them on my birthday. Super cute, I know. Got these little shoes, these mules. They're John I don't know if I'm saying that right, but I love a good mule, especially for this transition time. Little Chanel, you can never go wrong with it. Oh, and the last thing, I always have some sort of perfume in my bag, in every bag. I just put little samples. This is, I think, a Dia Sandorga one because I'm in a rush. I didn't think about it, but that's why you put a sample in your bag. This one's Jasmine, and it actually smells pretty good, so I'm gonna get a good feel for it. It is, oh my gosh, 316. You know what, not bad. I made it, I'm gonna head over to my sister's and go from here. 
They opened the showroom in April of this year, so it's still brand new and it is gorgeous. There are nine floors. We started with some hot towels at our tea time at the Blue Box Cafe by Daniel Boulard. Yes, there was breakfast at Tiffany's, but we definitely got the tea time menu. I got the Tiffany special tea, which was delicious. Cheers. Also, thank you, Akka, for the auntie figure eight head nod of approval. Every little cake and sandwich was so delicious. It was hard to choose which one I wanted. Here she went in with the scone, and now what's next? What is she gonna choose? Do we know? Yep, there we go. And here I am talking about what kind of engagement rings I want because my hunch was true. That was why we were here, which was a fun surprise. And because it was tea time, of course, we're gossiping a little here by my facial expression. <laughs> I went to the bathroom. I love checking out luxury bathrooms. This was beautiful. They had an entire floor of China. And then we hopped in the elevator to go to the floor of love and they took us into this incredible, beautiful VIP suite. They had a whole setup of treats and champagne, which was delightful. Yeah, this is like a private setup situation here. It's so cute. Oh. <laughs> Say that again. So we're getting the Miss America experience. This, this is a time to say that. <laughs> oh, thanks for hooking it up. I was like, if there's a time to pull the card. <laughs> Now's the time. So they literally come in here with like two diamonds at a time <laughs> to try on. But the, the gentleman helping us was like, Mama D knows her diamonds. I was like, Mama D does know her diamonds. We know that very well. <laughs> so they're out getting more. We're going to see what they come up with. Yeah. <laughs> I can't show you any of those, but. I'm just giving you an update. What I can show you is their classic six prong Tiffany engagement ring. Of course I had to try this one on. It is beautiful. We then went and browsed the rest of the floor after we had tried on all of our diamonds. And it was a great time. Thank you so much, Apka, for hooking it up. <laughs> Wait, dude. Say bye to the people. 